Hello and welcome to Megs. It's fun time. This is Megzine. and we are back here on Hypixel Skyblock. This is the vanilla server. If you guys like this episode, make sure you smack that like button. It really helps out the channel with YouTube views, YouTube searches, YouTube algorithm movement for the channel. If you subscribe to my channel and you want to get notifications when I have new videos out, all you got to do is go to my page, hit the notification bell, set your settings inside the notification bell. You'll get notifications whenever you want them, not just whenever YouTube wants to send them to you. Uh, well, subscribing to my channel does help out with the thousand subscriber push. You guys can come check out the videos. If you do like this video, you want to help support the channel, there's a share tab down below. There's links there to social media sites. There's a link that you can copy and post on your YouTube community page. Uh, with that, we're going to get started um, with a couple of notes. Uh, first thing first, <coughs> if we come in here to the community center here and go into the election room, Derpy's coming up. Which means in about four days or so, Derpy's going to be mayor. We're going to get more skill XP there. And then, so what I want to do is. That, I'm, I'm showing that specifically. On both of my uh, playthroughs right now, I want to leave my minions and not loot them until after Derpy becomes mayor. Um. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna leave them alone, let them let them ride. Um, I do probably need to switch out um, these guys. Yeah, I need to get down a sheep minion. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. How close are we to getting another minion? That's a good question. Two craftables. And have we made a sheep mint? We have not. I could go make a sheep minion. Okay, so we'll do that in this video. Um, you also have seen a bunch of books in my inventory here. So uh, I'm going to deal with those in just a second. Yeah. So uh, it goes to what's going on next. So, so let, let's handle that first. Um, if we come upstairs to Jacob here, we can see that I now have another uh, gold medal. And what I wanted to do was go ahead and get uh, a Mathematico and then let me down. Go ahead and... I did check. I don't have one yet. Um, I have enough. I don't think I do. Uh, let's. There we go. So, go ahead and turn this bad boy into. The uh, hurricane hub. Now we can go ahead and go up to the next level on this one. Involved with that be sex of enchanted, which wouldn't be hard for us to get. Let's see if we already have that. I do not. Okay, but that wouldn't be hard for us to get. So let let's plan on doing that. Let's go in here. We'll get this one enchanted. I'm going to cut the video. I'm going to get this one enchanted. I'm going to combine down all these books down to my the lowest forms. Get all this thing skinned together. I'll bring you guys back right here, okay? I'll see you guys in a second. And we're back. Sorry about that, guys. So, uh, what we want to do today is... Um, oh, let, me, let, me, let me show you what I did. I went ahead and condensed everything down. Um, we got uh, Turbo 2 Melon on our thing here, our uh, Melon Dicer, our Pumpkin Dicer here got uh, Pumpkin 2. Um, I had enough, I had a 3 up here and my Wheat O. Okay. My Wheat hoe here uh, had... Uh, three on it so i went ahead and put three on that and then i still have a three here to move up to four 
and then we're gonna leave four in here until uh, we get a silver medal in that's what we're gonna do we're gonna try to get all of these tools up to uh, four because I know I can I know I've gotten a bronze in each one of these tools so we can use the uh, turbo four books on these for right now <laughs> the exception with that is the mushroom uh, dicer cutter got it in here yeah this one I've already got four on this one. I could put five on this one because I've already won a silver in the uh, mushroom uh, contest. So there's that. So we can we can, we can do that one. And then uh, look, we're gonna we're gonna work on this one today. Um, by not by the end of this video, but by end of today, I will have armor set for this one set up. I don't think I have one yet for magic. No. Now, uh, the 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 original the goal is to actually get uh, combat twenty two. We're at twenty one right now, so hopefully we can uh, concentrate on that while Dorpy's mare. And I will try to go around today and tomorrow and grind out some. Um, actually, Marina's mare right now, and she she just got elected, didn't she? Yeah, it's Marina. That kind of... I was going to do it while the uh, mystical uh, thing was up, but I didn't get a chance to. It's fine. It's fine. We can always grind out in the uh, the end for uh, uh, money and also XP. So, no big deal. Um, next. Oh. Uh, I am going to pause soon and go get the uh, upgrade. This is so we can get this one over. I like that over here. I've got I've got everything else for I believe a Ford and a sugar cane, which won't take us long to do. Um, let's go to the new the new building here so this here is the new um pet location uh around the back here is a cat talk to her pet sitter dog which sells the uh xp items and some other stuff a uh, george in the back now and uh there's a quest line with George to get to uh, pet taming 60, but uh, it's 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 asinine right now. So, I mean, the, the quest isn't hard. You just got to turn in like rare or greater uh, rarity uh, pets, but the pets he as he's asking for, I thought they were going to be random, but apparently there's the same pets no matter what. If that's the case, that's kind of dumb. But uh, there's a complete list on the wiki, I believe. You can look those up. What you want to do is just go and try to get those pets and keep them back. Or if you're smart enough, you can get the lowest rarity one and just move it up to the rarity that he's going to ask for uh, over time and get those prepped for when you do get taming. So so if you're like me here and your taming skill is where's my, right here, 30, you're nowhere near like 50. So you don't have to worry about getting the extra 10 levels yet. Just go ahead right now. Start start uh, gathering up those uh, pets and uh, getting them up to the rarity that you're going to need to turn in, and that'll save you a lot a lot of money in the in the long run. And there's these guys in here now. Now we've we've seen B B before, and again she's only got three of the rarities. So you guys understand now. And then we have Hoot and Fran. So we click on Hoot here, Hoot. and then we click on Fran. Uh -huh. Hello there, adventurer. Meet me, lovely Al Hooty. We offer a special service here. For a small fee, we'll train pets and help them while you're off. While you're off doing your rope thing, Hoot Hooty here approves. Trust me. So, if you're interested in leaving your pet with us for a bit. And then I think you can click on her again. And there's one slot. There's a, more slots available. So uh, basically, 
this is the one you start out with. It starts a session. We will, I'll, I'll try to get a pet and stick it in there. That, that's about. And then there's right here, it says, unlock this slot by feeding Hoot Hoot a great uh, carrot. And right here is the free training levels that you have. Free training every day, 28,000. Okay. And then, um, This this is the cost. So and I thought you could get one of the cows, but I don't remember how. Is it does it cost a specific? It does, right here. Okay, so it wants us to to man. Did I put anything up on here? And let's say two point three million. Uh, and then we should be able to buy. This is. The new pet for the, the, the training thing. So what we want to do here is we, I believe we want him. We definitely want him to go into our inventory system. Let's get a pet that we're actually interested in leveling. Uh, our sheep pet. That's a good one. So what we can do now is uh, we can come in here and we can put and uh, this is the, the menu here. So we have a sheep pet in here. Begin training, right? Duration. We can add pet in your inventory. So we do have to give me an add in inventory. And uh, it says the number of days. I think we'll come in here for five days. This this is the training uh, uh, thing. You can you can switch to a specific level that you want him to be, or you can train him for five days. I'm just going to put him in for five days, but I do want my owl pet in there because it 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 does something special to do. So let's get the owl pet out also. And what the owl pet will do will. The uh, the owl pet will help train the, the the other pet that you have in here, and will also get training itself. So it will get, it will level up too. So uh, in a pre in a five days, so Friday, I'll come back here with this guys, and we'll we'll look at this, see how much XP the got. Remember this one's at seventy one, this one was at level one. That's the so we're good. Uh, click the begin. There we go. Now we got this one training. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Now that that's done, let me go and pause the video and go grind out the, the sure cannon for this uh, thing. And I'll see you guys in a second. All right. See you guys in a second. And we're back. So, didn't take long. <laughs> my, fields, my fields are pretty good and I got high. Uh, dang it. Those of you that haven't been paying attention to the series, we do have uh, crappie armor here. I do have the uh, mushroom pet here. I can pop out the um, bee pet here. Now, this is the bee pet that I want to use. I did go ahead and send over from Bingo my legendary here. I think what I want to do is go ahead and uh, level this one up too, and then go ahead and sell this for you guys. You guys can try uh, Guys to get off the AH there. Um, I think that'll be the best bet for this. And then we'll we'll see about uh, upgrading this one. We didn't get this one to legendary anyway, but I wanted to go ahead and get it to max level first. That's why we haven't done it yet. But I I I can use this one to boost farming fortune, which is really really good. I've used both. 
this one gives just a little bit more farming fortune. I don't know why. It doesn't seem like it would. From just the base stats there. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't put them out because stat wise it looks like this one's better. I don't know. Anyway, I, I do both. If I if I need if I need a little bit extra uh, help and I don't need the mushrooms, then I, I'll use the other one. I, I should probably get an elephant pad anyway. I'm rambling. Let's go ahead and get this thing made. So we got this here. We've got this bad boy right here. Be able to put in four stacks of these. There we go. Now the only thing else we need for this one is a. Um, Cultivating book, and I want to send the uh, bits for it. So I want to try if we can buy it. Oh yeah, we can totally do that. Um, quickly switch that out for that, and then should be able to get. Some. That's fine. That, that'll be enough. That combined with these, that should give us enough for the book. Come in here, farming. Do enchanted. It's make itself for more, but not better, if I'm not mistaken. Eh. Guys, it just dependent. So I, I, what I do is come in here. This is one thousand eight hundred, one million eight hundred, and then I come over here. I, I check the price over here. See how so it's a little bit more now. So we, we go into there. There's that amount. And, okay, so let's see how much a cultivating book is going to cost us. We can get the rest of it out of the bank, and then I'll just make the money back. So, uh, cultivating. There we go. Five million. Oh, doggy. Um... Maybe we should start buying sell these for five million, right? At uh, one one cookie would be two books. That'd be about ten million. Make a little bit of money off of that. Um, let's go ahead and withdraw three million. That should cover the book. I'm not doing that because I'm not. Hold on. Stop. 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 Let's get the book. And I'll go over it with you guys. Buy this trade at 500,000. I create a buy order. Let's do that. Okay. So the reason why I'm not. Doing that, I'm, I'm trying to get all of my sacks. So our next sack that we're trying to save up for here is the uh, dwarven sack, and uh, I think I want the rune sack also. I, I would like to have all of these and then start popping off um, 
a booster cookie for a, a, a pocket stack of sacks and then start upgrading all my sacks. So that, that's the plan right now. So the next one we're pushing for is the Dwarven Sack. And uh, as you can see, I do not have it just yet. We, we, we just got the Crystal Sack, so... Yeah. How are we doing? Pretty sure it's going to make us just fight. I'm really, really impatient when it comes to making videos. Watch straight out. That's five men. Yeah, yes. Yeah, oh, an extra man. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put this up. I don't actually need that right now. I'm going to leave it in my inventory. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and go over the sheep area. I still don't have this teleport. I need to do all my teleports one day. And uh, let's go ahead and get a level 2 uh, sheep minion. That will unlock the slot for us. And then we can put that one down to end the video off with. Um, I do have one more thing that I want to do. Oh. Let's go up here. The reason why we want a sheep minion, oh uh, uh, yeah, sheep minion, sheep minion down, is because that's our next set. <laughs> and if I can get it running while uh, Derpy's up, and we're, we're saving all of our experience up for Derpy, that'll be even better, right? So we can get a couple of days worth of uh, it running by itself. And I'll probably go ahead and move it up to rank four. That'll probably cost a little bit. Or I might grind out the rest of these. Maybe we can place it down, let it run today, and I'll come back and upgrade it when it gets to rank four. I'll go ahead and put the super compactor in there. We did get an extra super compactor, so I don't have to make one. We got one. There's the sheep minion recipe. But remember, we want level two so we can actually unlock the slot. I'm gonna keep going. We get like a, what was it, four step? Now, the the other slot, a uh, spot for this is over here, so I can go over there and show you guys that. If you play for any amount of time, you know where the two slots, the spots are for uh, grinding. This is the other one. So if you feel like you're, you're running low over there, this one will also give you rabbit, so there's that. Basically, what you want to do over here is come down here. If you want to kill rabbits as you go, you can. Over here. And if they start spawning over here also. And then you make your way back up this side right here. And you're back over here to where they were spawning again. And with, if you have cleave on, you, you should be able to kill these guys off for you. So whichever way you think spawns the most for you. I don't know that there's a, a particular difference here. Spawn rates. But you'll get a feel for it. So. Yeah, we'll do one more loop and we'll go over, back over to the other areas because we're just trying to get, I think, about three stacks. Oh, yeah, but I heard another one. All right, let's head back over to the other side. See what it looks like over there. Oh, 
Oh yeah, look at all these here. Oh, I'm in not <laughs> Listen to my wife talk in the back. <laughs> For my ask, Mister. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention. <laughs> just talking. <laughs> Let's run back over to the other side, see if we can get just a little bit more. Then we'll run over to the carpenter and see if we can't grab a. a uh, got this menu real quick. Rabbits. All right. Uh, let's see if that does it. If not, I'll grab some off the wall. Uh, Mr. Carpenter. I think it is. Nah. Okay, guys. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. All right, guys. They need to know my that's for all those doctors' names. Um. So I want to just went ahead and buy a couple more. Go ahead and get this made. Oh, that's not enough, is it? Well, crap. They're expensive. It's expensive to do it this way. When I have the money, I just I don't want to spend I don't want to spend all my money, so there we go. That should be tier four, right? And then the next tier, if we come into the collections here, should have unlocked is uh, enchanted. Great. So now let's take this back to our island. We will also need a uh, storage chest. Let's go ahead and just put this stuff in here. Okay. okay. No. Ooh. Good. For extra chest. <laughs> Thank God I remembered that. I mean, I think I have some in here anyway. This should give us medium. And I will need a lava bucket, so let's go ahead and get that one done also. I 
think that's it for right now. I could put a diamond spreading in, but I don't think I really need that. And uh, we'll put it across from the skeletons here. So. Oh, bucket. Super compactor. There we go. Got that set up. Now, there's one more thing that I want to do before we end the episode off with. It does involve us going over to the uh, deep caverns. I believe we still have a little bit of time left. Let's see. Yes, we're right at 30, so this is within the range of what we're going to do. Um, I have a surprise, hopefully. <laughs> Let's get our stuff back in. There we go. There. And I only care right now about getting my thing, so uh, I don't think I have any in here. Oh, and your sludges and yogs, that's not something I want to do on camera. So, Okay, so Mithril or Ice Walkers. We can go do Ice Walkers. Uh, we're at 56, or we're at, I'm sorry, 246 out of 50. If we do our four dailies for today, uh, we should be able to get this thing. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go grind out. Uh, the uh the other two the other four uh commissions for today and then uh we're going to uh complete this and get the teleport in the episode office so i'll bring you guys back in a second there we go guys we got one more to do i believe let's uh i believe we're going to it's going to be um not really it's fine we'll just use the regular one i gotta kill goblins so I'm gonna go up here and knock out these goblins real quick. At my usual spot. It won't take long. I shoot so fast now with this bow. Sometimes I shoot two or three at one time. Need a hundred goblins though. When you're first starting out in the mines here and you don't have good armor or good weapon for this kind of thing, it is kind of annoying to do the the uh, ice walkers and the goblin kills. I do like the uh, increased spawn rates that they got now for the ice walkers. It does help out with uh, people grinding versus people that need the just the, the commissions done. Glad they listened to the community on that one. Finally. Yeah. I'll show you guys in a second. Only because we got to go right back in there anyway. Turn in the glass for the commissions. Fine. We got plenty. There's plenty here. It's not like it's one of those guys that comes through with like the area blast thing. That's kind of what I was talking about. There. Shoot five or six at a time. Eighty-three percent. Kind of wasting arrows if you think about it. Come on. There we go. Done. So this is what I was talking about up here. Look, look how many more spawns up here there is. I'm not going to kill any because these guys are running. And then up through here, look at these. Look at this beautiful site here. So there, there's four, three or four little spawn right, like right here, 
and then there's three that'll spawn in this little thing here and like two more on the steps down and then there's all down here so if you're going to grind pick one spot if you're if you're going for commissions pick another spot and then um, you should be able to um you just gotta be more careful because uh more spawns means more more uh chances of them overwhelming you especially at low levels let's go up here turn this in that's my dailies travel scroll yeah baby oh we can teleport now now one more thing i want to do since we have the teleport unlocked we can now come in here through our teleport fast travel thing and we can come into the mines but there's a there's a forge here and uh, the recipe for the forge should be in the forge so if we come in here and we look in here uh is it in here yeah there's it is so we need we need 48 mithril 80 titanium 16 enchanted ender pearls and 25,000 and we should have that so let's grab a uh stack of mithril a uh, stack of titanium we will need two stacks of titanium go ahead and get two stacks of that and i should have uh some I have the ability to make them, so let's get that done. If we have extra, it'll go back in my... There we go. So, now we should be able to come into here. Come into here. This will take five hours. I will have this by the next episode. Uh, if you guys like this episode, make sure you smack that like button. It really helps out the channel with YouTube views, YouTube searches, YouTube algorithm movement for the channel. If you subscribe to my channel and you want to get notifications when I have new videos out, all you got to do is go to my page, hit the notification bell, set your settings inside the notification bell. You'll get notifications whenever you want them, not just whenever YouTube wants to send them to you. You can come check out the videos. If you do like this video, you want to share it with your friends, tell them what you like it. There's a share tab down below. There's links to the social media site. There's a link there for you to copy and post wherever you want. If you have any tips, tricks, or comments, put it in the comments down below. Don't forget to follow me on social media pages. Don't forget to set your notification settings for channel's notification bell. Um, I'll see you guys on the next episode.